Hey guys, it's Madison. Thanks for joining me in this faithful home. Super excited for today's video because I got a fun package in the mail that we are going to open up. It is a diaper bag from the brand Ox and Barn and they are sponsoring today's video, which is very exciting. They have gifted me this diaper bag, which came in handy because the diaper bag I have been using for my daughter for the last 16 months now. It's kind of falling apart because it was kind of cheap. So I'm very excited to unbox this. Here is a little bit of twist I'm doing for today's video. I'm going to be telling you what's in my diaper bag for my almost 18 month old, but she is potty training. She's almost fully potty trained at this point. And so it's kind of going to cater towards what I would need for a potty training toddler slash things for mom and that kind of stuff. And we're gonna open this box and I'm gonna take you through this diaper bag and tell you more about it. But before we begin today's video, if you are new to my channel, my name is Madison. I share about my faith and my family and I have a one and a half year old daughter now and I just share life and you can follow me over on Instagram at This Faithful Home. And I would love for you to hit that subscribe button so you feel welcomed into This Faithful Home with me. Okay, let's open up this box because I'm very excited for it. Okay, so the bag that they sent me is their Auburn edition. So that's the color. All of their bags are vegan leather. Oh my gosh. It is more beautiful in person. Look at this. Oh my gosh. Okay, so looking on their website, there was a lot of features that we need to go through. Looks like what I like is there is a passy holder. I had one originally on the thing, but it was like hard plastic and ran. Anyways, first part is insulated for milk if you need it or juice or water or whatever. But I'm probably gonna end up putting her water bottle in the side because she has a stainless steel like insulated one already. But there are pockets in here that I'll probably end up putting snacks in. There's a zipper pocket in the front. This thing does not lack with storage. There's another zipper pocket here that goes all the way down. Oh my gosh, look how far my hand goes into this. Okay. And then on this side, before we even get into the big bag, is another zipper pouch. What I like about this is it has the water bottle pouch on this side, but this is an enclosed zipper. My other bag had like where you could put wipes, but it was open and things would fall out of it so I could never put stuff in there. So I like that this closes because I'll always carry my own water bottle. I carry like a gigantic thing separate so it's not gonna go in the diaper bag ever, but her little one will fit perfectly on this side. And then they have padded straps on the back and it's adjustable and then it looks like there's a thing here too. Oh, maybe it's for like luggage when you like, not that I travel, but you could like put it onto your luggage so that it stays. And then there is a zipper pocket here. This is actually a very large zipper pocket for the back. I could probably fit my laptop in there. And then, oh, this is for the uh, stroller. You could clip your stroller or your diaper bag to your stroller which we have the Mockingbird stroller and it has a very big bottom. So I won't need to use this feature because I can just throw it in the bottom, but it has these hooks that you can do that. Okay, let's open up the inside. The diaper bag isn't like your normal, like open from the top bag. This zips all the way and the whole thing opens up. It's got two zipper oh no one waterproof zipper here and then one mesh pouch there let's take all this out okay so now you can get into the meat and potatoes of the bag there are a couple different pouches to organize it comes with a change mat 
that's a very nice floor less potty training now so I won't necessarily need to use that and then it has this cute clutch that I will probably put like medical stuff diaper cream sunscreen neosporin that kind of stuff in there but it is a cute clutch that if I wanted to take out and use it I could there is an interior pocket for water bottle there. Ooh, on both sides. And then several different storage options in here. So, no, there's actually a couple in here. This thing has a lot of storage that I'm going to need to decide how to open. If you needed to get in to this, you could take this part off too. But I probably would leave it on just because I don't want things to fall out. This is incredible and I'm excited to take you. I have all of my stuff laid out right here and we're gonna go through it and we're gonna pack this bag together. All right, I'll give you a quick overview of everything that's gonna go in this bag. We got diapers, wipes, cream, clothes, underwear, wet bags, life bag, toilet, we'll get into all that. But this is everything that's gonna go in the bag. All right, I'm gonna try to figure out the best way to explain everything as I'm packing this bag. But let's go ahead. <laughs> I don't even know like exactly where I'm going to want everything yet, but I do know that at the bottom of the bag, just because I hopefully will never need it, is a life vac. Highly recommend having this in a diaper bag for any age or at least in your car. This is basically a de-choker suction. If for some reason your baby or an adult is choking, this will literally save their life. Highly recommend it. We have one in my diaper bag and one in David's truck and one at my parents' house. So I'm gonna put that at the bottom just because I don't need it daily, obviously. I hope I never need it. Then the next big item is her toilet seat reducer. So like I said, my daughter is it's like 16 months right now, 17 months. She is potty training. We follow elimination communication. I've done that from birth. And so we are at a point where she can go several hours in underwear, but when we're out and about, right now we're still using diapers. But this is a foldable toilet seat. It has some suction on it, so I can put this down at a like public place, and then I know that she is sitting on something that is clean and hers, and then I can wipe it off, put it back in the drawstring bag, and then we have that. So it's a small seat for her to sit on. She is comfortable with it. This has come in handy. We have used this quite a bit. I'm gonna put this tucked in the back probably. Or maybe I could set it here too. <clears throat> we don't get to it all that often, but when we do, it is nice. Then let's go ahead and pack this little clutch. This is totally in a no particular order, but I think it'll be nice to have this packed. Oh, it's like a little wallet too. It has little card slots, but I'm gonna use it for like medical stuff. So we've got diaper cream, sunscreen, Teething tablets, these are natural by Highlands Baby. Um, reusable and disposable pad, because you never know when you or someone else might need a pad. So it's always good to have those. And then this little bag has band-aids, neosporin, burn cream, ear cleaners, hair ties, bobby pins, that kind of stuff. So that'll be more so for me if I need it. And looking around, I think that'll be everything that goes in this bag. This will be a nice clutch that I can throw in the back. I'll put it in the back there. And then go ahead and talk about diapers. So we use cloth diapers like 95% of the time. And so even though we're potty training right now, she's still in the cloth diapers and then she stays dry and I put her on the toilet that's like in her car or out in public or whatever or at home. But we have cloth diapers, so I'm going to put three of them in there. We also do use disposables on occasion. I use the Millie Moon, so I just picked up two of those from the closet. So we can stack diapers in there. And then we use uh, cloth wipes primarily. We do use disposable wipes as well. I don't have a pack of those. I didn't think about that. We have a pack in the car that we normally use. Um, I guess I could go grab a thing, but uh, these will be good to go in there. And then everything I mentioned, I will link down below for you guys. That way you can check them out as well. For nighttime, we use a cloth diaper and then a hemp insert. So I will make sure to have two of those 
because a lot of the times we're out and about and it gets late, so I will take her potty, put her in her nighttime diaper and pajamas, and then put her in the car. So it's nice to have this as an option because then whenever I need to, I can just grab a regular diaper, put an insert in for the nighttime, and then she is good. So I will put those up there. And then we've got clothing. So I'm gonna keep a couple pairs of shorts, a pair of underwear, some tops, and a dress for her if she needs it. And then wet bags. So if you do cloth diapering, wet bags are an essential because it's a waterproof bag that you put the wet diaper in. But if you are a toddler mom, I highly recommend getting a wet bag anyways because if your kid is like out of the park and they get muddy or dirty and you want to change them, you can throw the clothes in here and then this goes in the wash as well. So it'll keep everything else clean. So it is nice to carry around. I've got three of them right now because I always forget to put wet bags back in the diaper bag after I use them. So we will stick those in there. And then my daughter doesn't normally wear socks or shoes, but at certain places she will. So I've got these like gripper socks and then these are soft sole moccasins. These are only shoes she wears. They are breathable and flexible so that she can like really walk and feel the ground and not have like thick soled shoes. I'm not about that. I like for her to be able to develop her foot pattern as she's walking and feel the earth and that sensation grounding. So I've got those that I can throw in the bag as well. And my keys, I've got a push to start car so I don't need to have the keys on me. So it is nice that I can throw them in there front pockets. Wow, all of this went in the large pocket. I probably should have reconsidered. Like I said, I'm probably going to organize this multiple times because I have no idea what's going to like work best for me with this new bag because I literally didn't use any of this section. But two toys for her, just random things that she can play with. Oh, and I was going to put a few snacks. Hold on. All right. In this front section, I'm gonna put two pouches. These are Go Squeeze Organic applesauce. We like those. And then Nature's Bakery Fig Bars. We get those, both of those at Costco. I'm also gonna put a fork and a spoon for her, in case we're out about. It's a lot easier for her to use the smaller utensils. So I'm not gonna worry about, I don't have to worry about bottles of milk or breast milk or anything because she nurses, but it's right there. So I don't have to worry about bottles, so we can just go ahead and pack her snacks and her spoon and her fork. And then can't forget about the cute little passy pouch. I made a passy clip holder for her. Her pacifier is in her room, so she's napping. I'm not going to go in there and leave her, but I will put an extra one in there. And I hear her. She's waking up. But we forgot to put the change pad in. Okay. Let me go get Little Miss. Good morning. Hi. Did you have a good nap? You want to say hello? Can you say hello? Oh, you're so sweet. I love you. Oh, baby, I love you. Can I have a kiss? Are you looking at our new diaper bag? Is that so pretty? This is a gorgeous bag, you guys. Super thankful for Oxen Barn for sending it our way. Don't forget her water bottle needs to go on the side. Also, we've got a little label that has her name on it. Got it off Etsy. The water bottle is gonna go in this outside pocket. If I can do it with one hand. Gotta do things with one hand if you're a mom. Look at this, guys. This is a gorgeous, gorgeous diaper bag. I will leave the link for this one in this color and Oxen Barnes website down below for you guys. Thank you guys so much for watching today's video. And thank you again to Oxen Barn for sponsoring it and sending us this gorgeous diaper bag. I am super thankful that you are working with me and this just is, is gorgeous. I have not had anything this nice. So thank you so much. Lorelai, are you wanting to eat?
Oh my goodness, are you giving him a smile? Can you look right there and say cheese? Big stretch. We're gonna go see Dada, okay? Can we go show Dada our new diaper bag? No. Oh yeah? Is that gonna be so fun? Yeah. All right, can you tell our friends thanks for watching? Yeah, can you say bye-bye? Bye-bye. Bye-bye. If you are new to my channel, I would love for you to hit that subscribe button so you feel welcomed into this faithful home with me. You get to see more videos of me and Lorelai and just our life in general. So thank you so much. I will see you next time for another video. Bye, guys. Say bye-bye. 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 Okay. She said she's going bye-bye. Did you get the camera cap? Are you going to put it on? It goes right here, baby. Right there. Peek-a-boo. Bye, guys.